in taxes would be cut an average of $106 for a majority of tax filers in Wisconsin under a Republican proposal that lawmakers plan to vote on next week and then quickly send to Governor Tony Evers. The nearly $250 million income tax cut is the largest part of the GOP plan announced today. It would also reduce property taxes paid by manufacturers by nearly $45 million and cut general state debt by some $100 million. Republicans are tapping some of this state's projected $620 million budget surplus to pay for the tax cuts. Governor Evers, though, found fault with Republicans for not spending more money on schools. He said in a statement, and we quote him, the governor's education plan provides an opportunity for assembly Republicans to deliver on their promise to get to two-thirds funding for our schools before they take an eight-month vacation, while still providing $130 million to help reduce property taxes across our state. Well, this